<laughs> oh, it goes pretty fast! All right, today we are on the Roar Mantis. <laughs> this is going to be the new competition for the Surons. We're going to go for a little ride, get to a little area, talk about the bike. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Check the cars, no more cars. All right. <laughs> well, I can wheelie. And go! <laughs> yeah! Easy! Oh, that was awesome! Wow, in the beginning I thought it wouldn't do it, but the torque! It has amazing torque! It went right up that! Rides off-road good! Don't feel anything weird! <laughs> yeah, this is a pretty cool competition with the Suron, that's for sure. Let's go find, let's see if that area over there might be a little better. Yeah, yeah. Let's go up these stairs. Easily. So this is the Roar Mantis. Uh, it's a company based out in California. One of the coolest things I like th about this is it doesn't have linkage. So this is more like a dirt bike. Also, the motor, it's massive. It's got internal gearing so that you can actually just run the chain straight. So it goes right off of the gearing from the motor, kind of like how the Teleria is, um, right to your rear wheel. The swing arm is way beefier. The design of it, it's aluminum, but the rear subframe now, you have these bars that come out. So you have reinforcement all the way past your, all the way past your rear seat. That's super cool. Discs on the brakes are 203 millimeters. I have the rear brake uh, sensor disconnected. That's how I'm able to wheelie. You can just disconnect it and plug it right back in. No issues, no code comes up. Works perfectly fine. There's a horn pretty decently loud. Uh, a cool feature about this bike, you can just hit this little unlock button and it pops this hatch. And then you can get access to your battery. The cable for it, look how massive that is. The connector is way better. I mean, that's so good. These are hot swappable, just like the Suron. So you just pull, you know, shut off the breaker, turn the bike off, turn the breaker off, pop this off, battery comes right out. The mount for the uh, digital dash is pretty cool too. Off, you turn the bike on, let it do its loading screen, goes through, make sure everything's okay. So right now it's showing we have 64%, we're in park. This is your mileage and then it shows which mode you're in. So right now we're in sport. If I flip down that, it goes into eco. And on eco, you can actually um, go different eco. So right now it's in one. Right here, there's this D, I hit that. It goes into two and then three. So there's three modes of eco on this bike, which is really, really cool. The one is like walking, two's a little bit more than that. Three's a little bit more than that. Sport is gonna be your, your high-end uh, mode. It's got reverse. So you hold reverse button like this, that button's gonna pop up. So see, there's that little R, and then you give throttle, and then now you got reverse. <laughs> How cool is that? All right, so obviously we're gonna put it back in sport. Um, but yeah, this cool little dash right here, that thing's super awesome. Suspension feels really good. Uh, the rear, so the rear and the front are no markings to indicate what it is. Um, Roar, I guess, bought 
some sort of suspension and put it on, but it feels really good. Another cool thing about the drivetrain on this bike is there's no belts. And as you can tell, it's not very loud. So it's a chain drive, it's a 420, and it goes right back to this rear sprocket, which already comes with guards. So if you were wanting to ride off-road, it already has these protectors, so you don't have to worry about smashing uh, the chain. So they come in black, and then they also come in silver. The silver version comes with uh, chrome rims. So there is one at the shop at Segway of Hawaii, and we're, we'll go ahead and I'll, we'll check that out here later in the video. It has a max power output of 7,500 watts, max torque of 45 Newton meters, and the controller, the battery, and the motor is IPX7. The battery that it comes with is a lithium with Samsung cells, 60 volt, 35 amp hour. They claim going 15 miles an hour in eco, you can get 81 miles of range. So the weight of this is 150 pounds as it sits. If you pull the battery out, it's 122 pounds. Fork is 220 millimeters of travel and the rear shock is 75 millimeters of travel. Again, I had mentioned earlier, the rims front and rear are 19s. The controller is a Roar Fock controller, FOC. They claim a max speed of 52 miles per hour. The specs on this are amazing. So this bike here in Hawaii, you can buy them. They have it in stock. They have a black one and they have a silver one and more shipments are arriving. Uh, very soon. You can get these at Segway of Hawaii. This is 5,500 plus tax. The only downfall that I can see with this bike, for me, myself personally, is that I want one. <laughs> that, that's the downfall is I want one now. Oh, why did I have to ride it? <laughs> so, yeah, so this is the Roar Mantis. Um, let me know in the comments what you guys think about it, do you think that it's better than a stock Suron? I'm most likely gonna go out and get one. If you can't, that's, that's a deal. $5,500, this thing is amazing. Um, let's go ride it some more. <laughs> The throttle is smooth, like butter. <laughs> I like it. I like it. All right, let's go for a pretty decent long wheelie. Ready? Here we go. Oh. Let's take a look at the silver one. This silver one is beautiful. Oh. I'm getting a silver one. Look at those chrome rims. Though they're exactly the same, except this one's just painted silver with chrome rims. That one's black with black rims. I'm sure in the future you can order mix match. Like if you want a silver one with black rims or you want a black one with silver rims, you can do that as well. But, oh, the silver just pops. And this little seat thing actually isn't that big of a deal. You might look at it and be like, oh man, that looks really uncomfortable. But you sit here, you're up here and I don't even feel this. And then this is for like if you're hill climbing or something, you can get up on front. And then this would hold you from like when you're hill climbing. So <laughs> yeah, this silver, I'm sold on the silver. Yeah, thanks for watching. Come on down to Segway of Hawaii if you wanna check out this bike. All right, see you in the next one.